Hey everyone, Technometry here with a video for you guys. And now if you're not seeing Apple Intelligent on your iPhone, we're gonna walk you through how to get it and also explain why you might not be seeing it on your device. So let's get started. Now in order to get Apple Intelligent, first thing is you're gonna go into your setting on your iPhone, go to general, click on software update and update to iOS 18.1. Now there's a second part to this which is going to be importing is the device that you have. So even if you update to iOS 18.1, you need a compatible iPhone for Apple Intelligent. That means you need to have iPhone 15 Pro or the 15 Pro Max and the new iPhone 16 lineup which includes iPhone 16, 16 Plus, 16 Pro and then the 16 Pro Max. If you don't have any of these devices that we mentioned for your iPhone, you will not get Apple Intelligent even if you update to 18.1 as of right now unless Apple decides to change it. Now once you update your phone to iOS 18.1 and you have one of these compatible devices, what you're going to notice here in the settings section is a new setting called Apple Intelligent and Siri. And if I tap on that, you'll probably see a button that says join Apple Intelligent. If it's your very first time, you simply will tap on that and then wait a few hours or until you get a notification that says your iPhone is ready for Apple Intelligent and then you can tap on it and then turn this setting on and you'll be able to start using Apple Intelligent. And that's it for getting Apple Intelligent. You just need a compatible device on iOS 18.1. It'll get you it to Apple Intelligent. The other thing you might also wanna consider is if you're using a different language, change it to the United States language as some regions don't have it and if you see that it gets Apple Intelligent but not your region it might be because your region hasn't uh, have Apple Intelligent available yet and you'll have to come back and use or use the English language or when it's available, available for you. So that's how you get Apple Intelligent if you're not seeing it. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.